Kenmore Elite uh, refrigerator. I figured out the pump not pushing any gas. It doesn't have suction, doesn't have. Uh, uh, I've filled up with gas. You didn't do anything. I put the proper amount. So here's what I did. I pulled a compressor apart. You can see many YouTube video. They have that rotary engine, the piston pushing uh, an electric motor, pushing a piston like a, a car engine up and down, up and down. And that makes the uh, uh, compress, compressed air, uh, compressed gas. But this one is totally different. This one works. It's not a rotary. It's not a rotary motor. It's it's different. Let me start it up. This line goes here, which would be the high pressure line. I disconnected, desoldered it. So when the pump starts, it's a slow start. Start humming and slowly start up. Look at the coil here, the springs. That piece moving in and out really fast speed. And here's the piston in it, but it's not pushing air. It's supposed to be the suction this side. Let me. It was working before. Why is it not? So it's not rotary, that's because the electric magnet pushing in and out, in and out, in and out real fast. And that's what's moving the piston. It's probably the valves bad in it or something, I don't know. I didn't take it apart that much. But this whole thing is vibrating that line connects here but everything vibrates everything vibrates i wouldn't be surprised if these line would fail because that vibration that has a lot more vibration than than the rotary compressor I think that's about it, so I, I cannot tell anymore.